Hello, dear friends. Welcome to our daily prayers here. Welcome. My name is Shane Mart. I am broadcasting this prayer to you from the Spirit of Society of Richmond here in Richmond, Virginia. We're going to do a prayer, read a message from the book Happy Life by the Spirit, Joanna DeAngelis, through the medium Divaldo Franco. And this is message 64. Joanna says, Go for a walk outdoors, calmly rediscover nature, which has blessed your life. Unwind and exit the surrounding turmoil by letting your imagination soar. Avoid crowded places and breathe the fresh air of the woods, the mountains, the sea. Revisit concepts, relax, and bless life in whatever form it takes for you. Your present existence is plentiful with what you need to be happy. Isn't that beautiful? So we will ask us to Mary, invite you for a prayer to invite plenitude and contentment with everything that we have. So we Believe in spiritism that prayer is this transmission of thought from whoever is praying to the object of the prayer. And as thought is matter and thought has strength, we recommend that we close our eyes to move inwardly. And we also recommend that you repeat the words of the prayer mentally, whoever is praying, so we can amplify the effect of our prayer, shall we? Dear Mother, Father God, we pray for all of those on the earth who may be suffering. We pray for our loved ones, for those who we don't know. We pray for everyone who is in hospitals, psychiatric institutions, orphanages, refugee camps, all the homes of the earth, poor and rich, all of those who lack housing, who are feeling lonely and in despair. We pray, dear Lord, that the bountiful of your creation be bestowed upon all of us. May your divine providence be felt in every place on this blue dot of a planet. May your love and your kindness shower us with healing, soothing light. May we feel connected with you, soothing and harmonizing ourselves, feeling the contentment that comes from realizing all the blessings that we have in our lives, from all the help that we receive directly and indirectly, from both realms, from our colleagues or family members, the strangers in our lives in the physical realm, and the help we receive from the good spirits that are all around us. Dear Lord, we are thankful for the blessed opportunity of being alive. We thank you for the blessings of having this physical body, for this existence to be a blessing to us. May we resign in obedience to your designs. We are thankful, dear Lord, for everything that we have, and we are content to know that you care for each and every one of us. Please bless us with the opportunity of enjoying the nature around us. May you protect and guide not only all of humankind, but our friends in the lower kingdoms, the animals, the plants, the minerals, earth itself. The plentifulness of earth is seen everywhere. May we enjoy Mother Earth, blessing it 
and infinitely indebted to it for receiving us during this lifetime. May all the beings of this planet in all kingdoms rejoice knowing that we are progressing together. Dear Lord, we thank you for everything that we have. We ask you for protection, for inspiration, for strength and resignation. May you bless each and every hour of this day and night. May we fulfill your will for us in this lifetime. Asking for your blessings, we end the prayer today. And so be it. Dear friends, thank you so very much for joining me today. May your day or your night be blessed with all that nature has to offer. Go out, walk, enjoy, meditate. Take some time to reap the blessings of God all around us. Let us all feel connected with the Creator through its creatures. I hope that you have a wonderful day and a wonderful night. And until next time, for another moment of prayer, many blessings.